Hi everyone, welcome back to your vocabulary course and in this section we're going to be exploring prefixes. But not just any prefixes, we're going to be exploring negative prefixes. So, so prefixes that generally change the meaning of a word from being positive to negative. Okay, so we're going to be looking at un and other negative prefixes. So these are the prefixes that we're going to be exploring. We're going to be exploring un, dis, non, in or im, and then il or er. Yep, so these are our prefixes that generally mean not. Not something. Okay. Um, these are interesting prefixes and lots of prefixes I think are very interesting because as well as generally meaning not or negating a word, um, these, or at least some of these prefixes also mean different things as well depending on how we use them. So for example, un might just mean not, but it also can mean to not have or to have a lack of something. Yeah. Um, dis, although it means not, more accurately, it means the opposite of what you have. Yeah. Uh, non is an easy one because it literally does mean either no or not. Um, in or im, as well as being negative, can also mean into something. Um, but ill and er. Uh, Again, another easy one because it, they just generally mean not or no, yeah? So, in this section of your vocabulary course, this is what we're going to be exploring in a lot of detail. So I hope you like learning how to use prefixes, particularly negative prefixes, um, because they are a really important part of your vocabulary. 